I'm an artist and today we are going to fight AI. And this is part 2 because first video I made about it was well received and many of you were asking for a part 2, so here we are. And I was getting some comments in the first part like AI looks so much better, your lighting, your pose, your anatomy sucks and everything is so vibrant, that's so bad. Like man, seriously, do you really want to compare me to an AI that has eaten a billions of images from the greatest artists? Like I agree, I'm not perfect, but we are here to learn from our enemy and someday we will defeat it. So today in this video I am again going to fight AI, even if I am not as good as it is. And I like these vibrant colors, like what is wrong with them man? Why you don't like it? That's That looks beautiful. And now like in the previous part, you can click here if you didn't watch, we are going to fight some references first, AI references. In the last video it was like a fresh peaceful piece, uh, so now I want to try something different, maybe some gloomy and dark pictures. So I was thinking so, but after looking for like 10 minutes I understand that there are only cute girls, like man, look at her, she isn't scary, she is cute. And I expected some like a scary dark atmosphere, but there are only a hentai atmosphere, look at this, like, what the hell? So after 40 minutes of searching, I have this, and also this, and man, I want to draw both of them, but we can choose only one, so... Yes, we are going to use the power of randomness. So this will be number 1, and this will be number 2. And before we get a result, you can write in the comments which one you prefer. So let's go and... And by the way, I have an Instagram page where I'm more active, so you can check that out if you want. Link in the description below. But that's a secret. Don't tell anyone. Only for you. And that is what I will draw today, and I think these teeth can be a problem, because I just never had to draw them, only for the one time, but that wasn't really good. And there is the problem, that AI can draw everything, because it has eaten all sorts of images, but we humans are just so tight in our minds that we can't draw everything. And as an artist, I think you must observe and learn a lot to have just an incredibly big and powerful imagination to draw their, like, just everything you want. And by the way, maybe I knows how this looks, but it doesn't know the structure of this object. Like, for example, look at this collar. Like, here, this iron thorns place it, like, almost randomly. Like, what is going on, man? And I'm not even talking about this part of her neck. And why is that so? Because it's just doing almost random things without understanding the structure. And AI doesn't have like this 3D model in its head, but we humans do. And it feels like this thing is so tight that she can't even breathe normally. That's why she has her tongue outside maybe. But colors AI does just perfectly. Look at this blue color on her hair. That's a complementary color scheme, which contains two colors that are placed on the opposite sides from each other. And one more example of color theory. Look at her skin. It looks like a skin color, doesn't it? But if we place this color on the empty white canvas, it looks so much pink. But why here it looks like a skin color? That's because colors interact with each other, and this saturated pink background makes this pink color on her skin not so pink, and that's why you need a color theory. Ok, finally we are moving to the drawing, but you will never see this process from the start, because just after 40 minutes I start drawing, I get a blue screen. Photoshop and video files were corrupted, so there is nothing we can do, but I create a reserve copies of Photoshop files, so everything is not so bad, you know? And as always, I started with some rough sketch, 
corrected it in some places and then start drawing a line art. And teeth were a real challenge and I think she needs a really good dentist. Oh, I, I know how that she looks like. I think they are sisters. And I don't really understand what is that on her collar, so we are gonna put here a heart. Bring more love to this world, man. So now we have a line art and let's go to the flat colors and some shading and everything was going good until I realized that I don't like the line art. So the best solution here, uh, I just merge the line art layer with the face shading layer to have some more freedom because I was redrawing her jaw a lot and every time I changed my line art I needed to fill these holes or erase my shading layer because line art has another form now and I hope you understand what I'm talking about so sometimes it's just good to merge a line art with your shading layer to have more freedom. And I was changing a lot of things in this piece because it wasn't looking as good as I wanted it to look. So I think that art isn't only about your skill and how much you learn theory or practicing, it's also about fixing your mistakes again and again until you will be satisfying with the result. And if you finish the piece and you know that you were able to put more in this drawing but you didn't, the piece will be just unfinished for you. And sometimes it's really exciting to finish your drawing and then you think like, I can add some more details here and maybe make a better shading or something like that. And then you just compare the first version and this improved version and you're just happy that you continue to draw and made this piece looks even better. Oh man, that's too much philosophy. As much as the hair in the hair. And speaking about her hair, I made some rim light using purple color and make it separate from the hair she has in front of her face. And also hair behind her neck. I make it like it's glowing uh, with some dark blue and purple colors. And if it's glowing, it's a light source. So we will make this uh, like a little purple light on her neck. And she can be some idol maybe. And by the way, give her a name in the comments and like start with the, her name will be and her name here. And she will get name from the most popular comment. And one more thing she needs to get, it's a really good dentist because no matter how much I'm trying, her teeth looks terrible. So we are going to fix that. And I was thinking about next videos and I think it can be learning all fundamentals in one week like anatomy in one week perspective in one week and something like that because like now i see that i really miss the anatomy knowledge and perspective because i wasn't really studied that so if you don't want to end up exactly like me better study fundamentals Okay, now they look much more better than before. And now only some final touches left and... Here we are. So this piece was made by me and this one is our reference made by AI. And I like how I made this, uh, her tongue for example and her neck looks much better than AI has. And also they have slightly different expressions, uh, but I don't really think it make one of these pieces better or worse, so I'm happy with the result. Congratulations, you watched this video until the end and if you have something to say I'm waiting for your comments and as always. Thank you for watching. And don't forget to give her a name in the comments and visit my Instagram page if you want. And subscribe to my channel. Okay, this is the end now.